Welcome to Embedded World in Nuremberg. I'm here at the booth of Arrow, and I'm now together with Sarah from Tower Glass, and we will be talking about antennas mainly. Hi, Sarah. Please, first of all, would you introduce yourself and uh, your company to, your, to our audience? Yeah, of course. So my name is Sarah Healy. I'm one of the EMEA sales managers with Tower Glass. Uh, I have the pleasure of taking care of Ireland, the UK, and the Nordic regions, and I'm based in London. Um, so I've been with Tower Glass five years. Tower Glass is into its 20th year this year. So happy birthday to Tower Glass coming up. Um, and we are the IoT component company. Um, historically, we're known for our really large portfolio of antennas, probably one of the broadest portfolios in the industry. Um, so our antenna solutions cover GNSS, LTE, Wi-Fi and Bluetooth, NFC, ISM. Um, and yeah, we've really been diversifying our portfolio as well to become more of an IoT connectivity solution company. So our offering has expanded into magnetics. We have our cable assembly division. We have our RF accessories with filters and hybrid couplers, um, our speakers. So really trying to offer a full solution to the customer, not just the antenna. And uh, what are your product highlights? What are your new products, uh, the innovations you have on show here at the Embedded World? Yeah, absolutely. I would say at Tower Glass, you know, we have a huge team of engineers and innovation is really in our DNA. So I would say one of the solutions, which is probably most exciting that we launched last year is our invisible antenna. Um, so this comes kind of off the back of our standard black PCB flex antennas that a lot of customers would know. But as we work with our customers on their solutions, we realized there was a need maybe for a more transparent look to be used in glass and different applications so um, we developed the transparent antenna which is behind us um, it comes in the variants of multiband GNSS cellular or Wi-Fi Bluetooth um, as standard at the minute it comes with a FACRA connector because we found there was a need for it in the automotive sector um, but they're fully customizable but we do have standard options that customers can take away and do some prototyping with um, and the applications we've really seen a lot of interest in is automotive um, with police forces when they need something a little bit more covert. Um, we've seen it for LCD screens, so um, it's a very exciting development. Um, again, we partnered with a company and we're using a new material called Carbon Nanotube. So again, just constantly innovating and finding new materials to work with. Again, with the innovation, we have um, our cellular antennas. I think what we see more and more is customers need smaller devices, but they don't want to compromise on their cellular performance. So for us, trying to get um, a smaller embedded solution is of optimal performance. With optimal performance is very important to us. So we have our PCS68.a as well. Okay, have a nice show. Thank you very much, and thank you, Tara, for having us. <laughs>